What's going on YouTube? This is now guy in Cambodia coming at you. Uh, gonna entitle this guy, stop calling yourself MGTOW. Being set up. Being set up to look like a fool. Now when I first came across MGTOW, it's like, man, they hitting on all these points. Everything, pretty much 90-95% of the things that they saying about women is true. They're manipulative, you know, this is what happens when I take them out on a date, this is what happens when I do this, this is what happens when I do that. I said, man, this, this MGTOW is really rolling, and it is. I mean, I checked this one cat, Darius, pretty sure you MGTOW guys know him, Darius, he's like the Michael Jordan of the MGTOW videos. And he made one video, and it was a quarter of a million Views. Now, women, you in a lot of trouble. Because if one guy can make one video and a quarter million men agree with what this man is saying, and a quarter million men off one guy is saying, I'm not messing with women no more. Screw women. I'm done. I'm hanging it up. Uh, I'd rather play video games. I, I'd rather jack off. Uh, I'd rather hang with my homeboys. <laughs> uh, you in a lot of trouble. So just think. You got other guys out there. I can't think of their names right now. But you got other YouTubers out there. Just like Darius. And so if you take five guys like Darius. And they post one video. You have a million Young men talking about, I'm not messing with women anymore. I'm done. And so, as I started to look at these MGTOW videos more and more, keep in mind, this was about two years ago when I ran into this MGTOW thing. I was a little late. It was about two years ago. And after I sat there and agreed with most of the stuff they were saying, it was something that didn't sit right in my soul still. Because if I was around, if I if I was in a room full of one million men talking about they're not messing with women anymore, I would get the hell out that room. I would sleep with one eye open. I, I'm not hanging around. I'm not hanging around uh, five dudes, four dudes, three, two, one. That's talking about I'm done with women. It, it's something about guys talking about they done with women. It, it, it that don't sit right with me. Uh, it, it seems like a, a form of homosexuality to me. I like to hang around guys that like to hang around women. You know, women, they they bear children. Uh, yes, it's true. A lot of women are nothing but adult children. Uh, but they have children. So obviously the creator had to create them a certain way. So that they would be able to nurture a child. You know, they had to create them kind of childish. And, you know, there's a side to all the stuff that women are that I still like. I just don't like the way the court system has screwed everything. I understand, guys, is that it's your government that messed up the family. It's your government that removed men from your homes. Because the government has manipulated the woman. And the Bible says that the woman is the weaker vessel. That's why she manipulates, because she's been manipulated. It's up to you as men to stand up and be men. And if they don't want to, if you want to cross a woman and she don't want to accept what you're saying, then move on. If you can't find a woman under this jurisdiction, then go to another jurisdiction. Because the only, the only route I see in men talking about they're not messing with women anymore is homosexuality. And, uh, yeah, that's not... Mm -mm. You got so many down low males out here, it's, it's, it's becoming ridiculous. You know they putting stuff in the food, all this estrogen, all this soy in the food. And that's why you got a lot of down low males walking around out here. Talking about they can't stand women. And what makes me mad is when I talk about the facts of how women need to behave and 
how women need to treat men. And some woman out there will come across to me and say, oh, you must be MGTOW. And I say, don't don't associate me with no MGTOW because I'm stating the facts. I'm stating the facts. Don't See, there we go again with people trying to box you. People are always trying to box you in into some group and this whole country is based on not only manipulation but division uh, they, it's all about divide and conquer uh, women against men um, you know mother versus daughter father versus son bulls versus lakers Sox versus cubs they have to keep the division to maintain their rule so you cannot fall into the trap of groups, Antifa, Black Lives Matter, who's not, Black Lives Matter is not even ran by a black person. A black person did not start Black Lives Matter. So you want to be careful of these groups and these titles. Don't don't get boxed in because it's a trap. I love women. I stated in a previous video, I love my, I love my mother. I stated that first. Because you have a bunch of women, when you start stating facts, they automatically label you oh, uh, that you hate women. That's their, um, you know, how do you call it? That, that, that's their, uh, that, that, that's that's what makes them feel better. Or, or he, he must be gay, or he's MGTOW, or the, you know. You make sure that you let young guys I'm speaking to, make sure you let these women know that you're not associated with no MGTOW. Again, there's something about... One million, two million men all getting together talking about they're not messing with women anymore. Don't don't come around. Don't come around me. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not with that. You know what I'm saying? Those guys, you, you MGTOW, them. No, don't come around me. Because if you ain't dealing with no women, then you you dealing with some Hershey Highway <laughs> type stuff. You ain't. You know, uh, uh, men are gonna want women. A lot of those guys who follow MGTOW, they still miserable. At the end of the day, they still thinking about women. At the end of the day, and so then they go to they go to guys like Darius because they need they need more of the drug to get themselves a reason why they should why they should hate women. Even though deep down inside they don't hate women, they want to love women. Uh, they adore women. I adore women. I love women. Uh, there's a side to their manipulative uh, their manipulative behavior that I even like. It's their way of being a woman. After all. Uh, wasn't Eve made from Adam's rib? So it must be a part of them that men 